what's up my name is Taylor and welcome to another League of Legends video but today we're playing as Malphite in the top lane and I'm starting this video a little late because I was kind of iffy if I should record this but I'm gonna record it because we are against a Scion top and you know I was so excited because like everyone we, we this is ranked by the way this is a ranked draft pick so I was so excited because I'm like I saw the Jin, I saw the Scion, and then I saw a Kha'Zix and a Brom. So I'm like, hmm, wh I, what champion should I go? And then I'm like, oh wait, there's Malphite. And then the last person chooses that Ziggs that you see in the mid lane. So before we get too far into this, I'd like to say happy birthday to my dad. Because it is my dad's birthday today. I am recording it. Terrible son I am. I am recording on his birthday. But just want to say happy birthday because he's an awesome dad and I wish him the best of birthdays for the rest of the evening but we are here to play Malphite because Malphite is so dumb against 80 champions maybe not this scion until like in my doormail but for the most part when you go against a team with most lady he's really dumb yeah. Yes. 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 Okay. All right. After this. But first blood happening in the mid lane from a nice gang from our nearly jungle. Six got Drake. And we met in a ranking just like this. I actually played Malphite Top when I first met him. And he actually he or she actually played nearly jungle. So this is nice. And he or she asked me to play ranking, and I did, so yeah, here we are. Things are going to be really slow here, basically just going to be farming, because I'm not going to be really that aggressive until I get either bombing cinder, or like, more armor, because science more tanky than me, he will out to stay me in the fights. Even though, as you can see here, I'm not trying to necessarily initiate a fight. Six God Drake knows that I'm a pretty good mouth fight. Ooh, ooh. ooh let's, let's, let's do this. Let's do this. Alright, I'm gonna die. You know, you know, I thought. He was gonna get the kill right there, but you know it happens. It happens. Yeah. Right. There we go. There's a the kill. All right. So two on Italy right there. Unfortunately, I died for it, but you know stuff happens. Stuff happens, guys. We're gonna be just good. I'm just gonna buy another cloth armor there just for future items, and we're gonna go back in lane. We're gonna farm even farm more now. We're gonna be really passive because I just. You know, I, I just died right there, and I didn't even get an assist because it nearly messed up, but it's fine, it's fine. You know, it's fine. He or she is 2-0, and oh, and you know what? He or she's going to carry. You know, I wish I knew in real life, so I didn't have to keep saying he or she, but he or she's going to carry. So Sion uses DP. He doesn't have flash either. He's going to go for the same item I am. Sunfire Cape. Because honestly, when you're a tank, Sunfire Cape is amazing. Is he 6? Okay, he is 6, so I should not be here. As it is, I'm gonna get a frozen... As it is, I'm gonna get a Thornmail. And after the Sunfire Cape, I'm gonna get Ninja Tavis or Thornmail. And then after that, I'm gonna get Frozen Heart because... Sion has some sort of attack speed. Jin has a little bit of attack speed. Kha'Zix is the main reason why I'm getting it because of attack speed. This 
gonna get all that, get to level 6, and you see, these minions are doing nothing to me. They're doing nothing to me, and I wish I had some fire right now so I could've gotten some more of those minions. But it's all fine, it's all fine. Cause we're just gonna farm. And I don't know if I posted a Malphite video on my other channel except for that Twisted Treeline game where I was a complete and utter wreck that game. But I hope that this video will show you how awesome of a Malphite top laner I am because I honestly love the champion. It's honestly one of my favorite top laners as long as they don't have too much AP on the enemy team. And honestly, Malphite puts in the work. Like, even when you're behind, as long as you can get that nice ultimate off, that's all you need. All you need is that ultimate, and you help your team out so much. And you know what? You know, I said I was gonna be a pansy, and I was gonna be pacifist, but you know what? We need to trade a little bit, because... He has more fun with me. He is a kill. And we just need to farm a little bit more. Six got Drake. Getting a little zesty. Whoever he is. But, you know. You know, we in this. We in this. Kill in the mid lane. Good job, Andy, with the nice tivers. Oh, there's a pink warrior. Wow, that's an awesome fucking <laughs> It moves when I hit it. You know, I kind of wish that I knew how much stacks I had, like, so I could gauge like, whether to go in on him or not. But I guess, you know, if you were smart, you could probably just like, calculate how many stacks I had, he had based on how much health he has. But right now, I'm just gonna back, get my bomby center, and come back right into lane. You know, he can disrupt my ult right now with that nice E, if he chooses so, is he? No, but I'm just gonna go back and free. Nice. Get myself a pot right there and get back into lane. And now with the bombing center, we can be aggressive as heck as we want. Because bombing center will do more damage. Bombing center can pick up more minions. I almost said minion, but minions. If I step into them, and also I have more health. And with Scion who can get basically infinite health if the game goes long enough, you know? that's gonna be really necessary, having health to sustain. Yeah! I'm gonna- I'm trying! I am obviously trying hard enough! Yes? As long as you don't use so much mana. We can just keep poking like this. Here we go. And you know what, honestly, I want to TP on this. But on second thought, I'd rather, I'd rather stop this time from pushing so hard for you. Okay, six got Drake's out of there. Alright, sign back, and I'm gonna miss it. And TP, alright, alright. Ooh, that nice ultimate. But, I'm really debating the ult, TP and ult somewhere. 
but nowhere really needs to, a gank or whatever right now. I'll just stay here. He had a full set fire, which is pretty. So he has way more health than me, but he should be able to survive even if I get like fully comboed and ulted. Let's go in on this. Boom! Unstoppable four is gonna get two of them. Could go for more. There we go. Not a kill for the Annie right there. I'm gonna get out of here because I'm paying too much. Time. And there we go. And almost clean is. Cyan's probably gonna get top tower, but it was well worth it. Well worth it. We got a lot of them. And he getting more kills. And and Cyan did not get top tower, which is awesome. So now we just go up there and we just stop him from pushing that tower. Alright, so gonna pretty much build full armor there's no reason like as a Malfoy player you re really don't need to build AP unless one you're going AP Malfoy or two you kind of want the AP for the extra damage but in this game I'm basically just gonna build tank and full armor tank door mail like I pretty much don't die and even if you do have it oh gosh even if you do have an AP opponent on the enemy team like Ziggs, you can always build a defensive AP item like a spear Passage or like a Banshee Fell or even a ZZ Rock portal because it gives you armor, health regeneration, and magic with this. So they're gonna get the first Cloud Drake. Not that important, but it will give them more out of combat movement speed to run away from me to engage on other people, etc. 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 You know what? This is basically a farm lane on top because I don't as tank Malphite, especially in this matchup, you don't really have enough damage to to whittle down a scion because constantly getting health. See, like that doesn't do enough damage. That doesn't do enough, really a lot of damage. So essentially. My role in this game is to just become peel for my carry, for the Annie, for the for six card Drake, Nidalee jungle, and the Sibber. Even though you know Annie is just roaming around now getting kills, but basically my role is to just soak up as much damage as possible, peel with my ultimate, and then allow my team to just out damage and get all of that off. And another thing that I can do is I can keep this Scion here and by keeping this Scion here he cannot help his team unless he wants me unless he wants to give it a turn because honestly I think that I am more um, I honestly think I am more pushing presence than he does and I'm sorry for 6 card, 2 6 card Drake right there but I didn't notice he was fighting the Kha'Zix and yeah so I definitely could have helped there, but but it's okay. Second death, it's not the worst thing that could happen. But it's gonna paint that sign for a second. Okay, there he is. And honestly, right now he has a banshee trail, which is really scary. So I'm just gonna back here. I'm gonna buy my ninja tab eyes. Yep. 
and then that and then we can get our farsight alteration and then start building it to Thornmill after that. So he has a lot of power. Alright. And now we get our cloth armor to build into our Thornmill. Now I'm not really informative about league stat, about champion stats and like how to play different champions or like how to play the champion I'm playing at, but they're gonna get this first circle. But one thing is that as Malphite like your W uh, gives you 30% increased armor and your W autos and your E damage actually increases the more armor you get. So if you get more armor then your autos right here, your W autos right here and your E damage will actually increase. Which is awesome. And honestly, you know what come here. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. I had to pop this whole shit. Oh god. Ah, and I died. Alright. Sorry about the phone. But unfortunately it couldn't do be one. Scion Scion put way too much pressure on me. All of that nice CC and damage output, unfortunately, got me killed. But it's no biggie, no biggie. The main thing is that my my teammates keep putting the pressure on them because as long as I keep the sign away, as long as Kha'Zix has to come to gank me because Sion can't deal with me himself, it'll be well worth it. And like Annie's coming right here to deal with the sign, like. We can like sh shut down, not shut down, but we can CC lock it basically. So like he dies, even if he has all of this, all of this. Um, I'm fine. So he's an all right there. Uh, I don't know why she ulted right there, but now Sign doesn't have all, which is even gonna be huge because now if he wants a TPM, he doesn't have all to initiate. And honestly, as Malphite, you're pretty much this is pretty much how a laning phase is gonna go, unless like you're against an AD Bruiser or a champion. You're basically just gonna farm up and wait for an opportunity to do this. So like, you go right here. Hopefully, Cobbs and die. Hopefully, Karma doesn't die me. And then you do this. And you know, not necessarily, not necessarily die like that. But you see, like I did so much damage. I shouldn't have. Once I saw the saver die, I should have canceled my TV. But you know, things happen. Things happen. You know, I think I gave Kyle the kill. No, I gave the Jim the kill. So that's kind of scary. But at the same time, well worth it. Because when he curtic all of that, I can't ult him like that. I can't use my unstoppable force to like knock him off and disrupt the ult. And I won't be 3 them. I base I got the Jin and the Kha'Zix to like below half, even like when they won. So yeah, that's, that's something. All right, so and Annie just constantly just killing the Zin, shutting down, and he just ulted. He just ulted. He like straight up just ulted. Oh, what's wrong? What's wrong, Siren? You don't want to fight me. You want to fight me? Yeah, that's right. You back up. You back up. You back the H up, and that bot lane is in a huge heap of trouble. Oh, oh, they got the kill. They got the kill. Oh, what am I talking about? What am I. Forget everything I'm saying. My team is doing fine. My team is doing. Is going the distance. Doing the good stuff and he actually has more damage because of his grass. The fact that he keeps regenerating his health like the little trick he is. And I can actually beat him now. Oh gosh. Run! Run from the scary Scion. 
for her, and yes, he does have tier 2 boots on faster, thankfully. But my team, my team, what was I worrying about? My team just went ham, and they just got the Drake. They, none of them died, and they just, oh, you're not good. You know, I hate when that happens. I hate, like, when you hit them, and somehow they still recall. Like, I don't like that at all. So, there, so either I'm gonna take this turret right now, or Sam's gonna TP to it and waste his TP while my TP is gonna be up in 130. Ooh, Jin really hit the camera. Oh, their entire team is there. Ooh, and you hear the signal, which means. Wait, wait, Tibbers? Tibbers? Tib oh, no, they're all there. Wait. But they basically got everyone, so I can like say be like push this hot turn. Please, please. I I just want the turret, please. Please, please. Just just let me get this. Yes. All right, and now we have our Thornwell boys. So now. You're gonna see all the damage we're gonna be doing back to them since half of them rely on autos to do their damage. And then, once we get even more tankier, you're gonna realize how much nothing they're gonna be doing to me. So, there we go. There we go. There is our Thornmail. And we're gonna get that Ruby Crystal to build into. You know what? Let's get the Randuits. Because having that slow and being able to slow them down is gonna be amazing and now since my top is pushed and i can't really fight the sign anymore i'm just gonna be going with my teammates right here basically just gonna be with my teammates there playing waves trying to appeal for them and actually everyone is coming mid and they should be able to get that because there's two we want to get the gin there we go, next kill for Sierra. And like everyone is mid. Like every single one of them is mid. Like I don't understand why they're all mid. Oh dang, that did a lot of damage. Because unfortunately we don't have health, we have armor. And especially against that Ziggs, who still has AP. Unfortunately, that's not gonna be a thing. Unfortunately, I cannot do enough damage against him. Or, like, sustain against him. So unfortunately, my team did not get off the stuff, the, the Annie's Tiver or Stun especially. And like, I don't know what happened to Tiver, but like she just ran the heck out of there after like Scion failed ulted, and like they aced them. But you know what, it's not over. You know what, this number right there means nothing. You know what matters? Winning the game. But you know what, it is going to be tough, it is going to be tough, but this Jin, this Jin is the big problem to me winning, because of the fact that he has 
armor pin out of the wazoo. Like. And his dumb death fire touch and slow. Oh, yes, forever. And his dumb slows. And his snares. And his ultimate that does percentage health or percentage damage equal to your missing health. He's a problem. He's a, and I'm taking his blue buff. I'm gonna take this blue buff. Unfortunately, but they're dead. You know, I could have TP'd and ulted right there, but you know what? They were all dungeon rings, as some people like to say. They were all dungeon rings. They were all dead before I could even do anything. And you know what? I could have done something, but then I would have died in the process. Because unfortunately, Kha'Zix and Jin have way too much armor red, and I have no MR for the Zin for the Ziggs. So we're just gonna have to deal with them. I think what we have to do is one, my team has to follow up when I ult the Ziggs or Jin or Kha'Zix, whoever it may be, and we just need to like burst that guy down like the Dickens. Need to burst that person down that I ult like the Dickens. I also need to try and ult as many people as possible. Because the more people I ult, the more people that my team doesn't have to worry about. But, this turret's almost dead. And we're just gonna push the wave up a little more. You know, we can actually, I can actually ult and bring the turret. But you know what, that is way too risky. That is way too risky, we're just gonna take the turret. I don't know why she just used her ult, but... Well, she did. <sighs> you don't have vision of them. Something. They're going up to kill the nymph. They're up to get six god Drake right now. Ooh, can can we stop the cosmics? Okay, he flashed. He or she flashed, I don't know. If six got Drake is a man or a woman, but we're just gonna keep going. And he got a ZZ Rock portal, this scion. This scion got a ZZ Rock portal. Well I don't want I don't like your ZZ Rock portal. I'm just gonna get rid of it. No, sir. You know what? There's everything. And you know what? Get out of my house. And like, my team is... My team are just the most. You know what? It's one thing if it's like if it's like a boss raid and like you are like one v fives, one v fiving someone. But it's another thing where I'm taking everything and like I took like a zi I took the zig zone. I took like all of the damage from the gin and stuff. But. If you're just gonna run away just because you hear a Scion ulting at you, then sir, sir, you need to start helping out. So we have a random with right now, we're gonna build a Spirit Facade just for the CDR and the health regen that it gives and the AMR. Because apparently I'm gonna need that because, you know, my team doesn't wanna, you know, fight when I when I niche, when I ult them and the peels so you know 
we, we just have to get power. I'm just gonna say this, 29 seconds. You know what, you see a 448 armor? And they still shred through me? It's insane. Sometimes, sometimes I play the legend. And I'm like, man, I have 500. I have 500 AP, but I can't kill them. It's because, and Kha'Zix is gonna kill them unless. Wait, wait. Okay, now he's he's good. Oh, oh, wait. No, okay. Still alive. Oh gosh. Eh. No. Right. I'm gonna come down here and help Six God Drake. Cause this side is tanky F. Like we honestly just did not. No. Just like, no. How did they get down here so quickly? By the way, can I just say how did they get? They were like at Baron Pit, and then they suddenly got down to bot lane. Like what? Like what? I don't. You know, I don't know how they did it, but that is ridiculous. There you go, Braum is down, so now we can start pursuing. Oh gosh, this Kha'Zix. This Kha'Zix is pushing. Oh man, this game is so much harder than it needs to be. I, I basically need to say my ult for the Jin. It's like his ult is what's screwing everyone over. No, I don't think there's any way we're gonna contest that. Alright. Wow. Holy mess. Okay, we got Ziggs. We got one piece of the puzzle. Now, we can just come up and we can just 4v5 them right now. But you know what? You know what? You guys are dungeon rings right now! Dunion ring, there we go, there's the randuit, there's all that night that and back here, back here. And Cyan actually getting zoned out, so there's the flash. And I'm trying to put all the slows out. Spawn. There we go, killing the Cyan. And slow, slow. There we go, there we go. Good job. And now my team can push because I'm out of mana. And now when we back we can get our Spectre's Cow and another Ruby Crystal, I'm pretty sure. Yup, there we go, Spectre's Cow and a Ruby Crystal. And Six God Drake wants to kill the Kha'Zix. There we go, there's the Kha'Zix. Now we can bear it. Now we can bear it. Jungler's dead. Scion's dead. 
the only one who can really contest it is the gym. But look at all this damage coming off my team. You see, when my team wants to get all damage, they do it. There we go, there's the bear boss. Gonna bag, get our Kindle gem. And then that'll be that. And then we're gonna go in. We're gonna try and stop them again. Just like we did. And you know what? My team, you know what? I, I called you guys pansies. I'm sorry. You know, I get really into this game, we can call it. And you guys are all wonderful, awesome people. Skilled, probably more skilled than I will ever be at this game. So good, good for you guys. You guys are all good players. Except I really don't know what this man yeah, just happened for. And I never seen I only boots and silver before either. Okay. But it seems like we're gonna be pushing bottom a little bit. And Annie? No. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. I'm just absorbing all of this damage. Look at all the damage going through. Thank you so much! Ah. Run away everyone! Oh no, Silver died. Run away! Alright. We're out of there. We're out of there. Unfortunately we have to fly. And unfortunately that all happened because Andy got caught. But still, still though, we good. We good, we good, you know, we good. Okay, no. Jin plus Braum equals cancer. I thought, I thought Ash plus Braum is cancer. Jin plus Braum is even more cancer. Oh, damn. 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 Damn, wait. Give me the food. Give me why why not? Oh damn! There we go, killing them. Come on. There we go. There we go. Two of them killed. For a nice 40 seconds. the elder spawning in a minute oh it's my pal Ziggs it's my pal Ziggs what you want Zig? what you want what you trying to do what you trying to do what you trying to do, what you trying to do? okay Jin is back up so now it's something to note about I'm saving my old for Jin but we should get this turret Alright, so unfortunately, Nidalee and Karma got wrecked right here, but I can just, oh, oh, there he is, there's a curtain call, and BOOM! Get in the gin. Of course, you couldn't see the Karma, but I got the gin. So we're just gonna clear a bot lane because two of our teammates are dead. Can't really do anything. We could, but it's really risky because. Oh! Damn! Alright, alright. Oh gosh. Oh no. Oh no. She's all sorts of dead. Oh no. There, there it is. Oh 
Oh gosh, this malfight is so tanky. Alright, it's back now. Cause that malfight is scary F. He is scary F. That scion is scary F. And Team, 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 be careful, team, be careful, team, 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 team. Oh, there we go. There's the unstoppable. Dead. Yes, 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 there we go. Aw. Oh. I hope there's Kha'Zix. Okay, no. Alright. Let's do this outer. We have one Drake, but the true damage is gonna be huge. Forty three minute game, guys. Holy shoot. Honestly guys, my head is starting to hurt when I played so much music. I should really stop after this. Right, so there you go, got Elder. There we go, got Elder. Gonna back, get my dead man's plate. And then we'll be full build. There you go. You know what? I'm curious why the Scion didn't get ZZ Rock. I don't know, just like something I thought of. Hey, 536 armor. Nice. Nice. I I've honestly have never had that much armor before. But we got it. We got it. Is that Jin? No, Kha'Zix. 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 There we go. There's a GA pop. Now Brom's dead. And now, boom, seismic shard. Kha'Zix is dead. Now we get this Baron well. Nice and good Baron Bob. Oh my. Uh, unfortunately, did not get that Baron Bob. But you know what? Let's not do this. Yeah. This is the stand aside just in case they use everything to kill that Zibber. Now I'm gonna get my elixir of iron. Oh, didn't get it. That was Annie. There we go. Elixir of iron. Alright, this is just going. Boom, boom. Just charge it in like this. I'm 
fine. You know, I always want to charge their people, even if they have Baron, because it's like, what can they do to me? But, you know, this is that, this is a lot of damage. That is a lot of damage that's towards me. Oh my gosh. Alright. 48 minutes. Wow. One team fight determines this entire game. Okay. Alright, now my list of irons are going to expire right now. Around right now. Alright. Damn son, they were not protecting their ADK and there's a failed flash. This, the enemy team was not protecting their AD carries. For whatever reason, we just got a nice 3 for 0 on them. Good at any stun, that timber stun. Awesome any timber stun. And now we can just push this bot lane. Now we can just push this bot lane and go ham on that. Dude, my ult's back in 57 seconds. There we go. Nice kill. And now, let's focus this. Wow, I am lagging so hard. Oh my gosh, I think my I think it's gonna be lagging right now with the OBS. Holy shoot. Whoa, when did that happen? Oh gosh. Ah! Oh well. So I have no idea when that started to happen, but oh my gosh. I'm kind of debating whether to get a G8. Let's, you know what? Let's switch this out. And let's get a G8. Because hopefully, even after all of that, I'll be able to survive. Oh gosh. Go. Oh no. Oh no. And she's dead. Oh gosh, oh no, 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 don't throw, don't, 
don't, don't, don't, please don't, I, I don't. First off, me teleporting from inside their base onto this turret was a bad idea. Secondly, I had no idea that the mid lane was being pushed so much. So this, this, these turrets are like almost dead. But you know, stuff happens. You know, I am lagging on. My FPS is going on so hard. So sorry for any lag going on, but I'm pretty sure it's OBS and stuff. But oh my god, please don't, guys, guys, what the. Wait, he didn't back. And we got him. I don't know why Zayce didn't back, but we got him. But they are Baron. We probably have to fight him with Baron because, like, I mean, fighting him without Baron is also Okay, so they want to do Elder. Probably the best option since they are Baron. Alright, so two of us have GAs. Two of them have GAs? No, just Kazi. Yeah! I'm almost done already. I... And two of them died. So luckily... That was awarded and we got both of them. I'm just gonna clear this out, then I can hopefully get to them in 80 seconds because my TV will be up. Alright. I'm just gonna walk over there. Hopefully I mean we would take that. But struggling with it a little bit. But this will be a 3v5. My old will probably be up by the time I walk up there. I'll be back now, yeah, back now. So I might as well take care of top. Oh, they're doing elder. Alright, let's go. Let's do honor. Also for 20 seconds. So... This game is taking me too long. It's so much longer than you can. Yeah, I knew it. They're gonna try and go on the top inhibitor. Yep. I. Whoa! You stop right there, son. You stop right there, son. All right. It's back. Get a elixir iron. for a lot of my mana to regen and let's go I'm pretty sure we're gonna do full frontal mid
Alright, let's go. Let's go. And let's just get the Nexus. And that'll be a nice GG. Oof. That took way longer than I expected. And I'm sorry the video lags at like pretty much every point because my FPS dropped so low. And I'm pretty sure it will. Pretty sure. Yeah. Pretty sure it lagged enough. That'll be a nice GG. 20 LP GG. Friend, gonna give you all. The friendly, cause you are all friendly. friendly. Friendly, there we go. And this is like so much. And let's just see this damage. Uh, Forty thousand, not bad. But let's see damage taken. Wow, so much damage. Taken. But I hope you guys enjoyed the uh, video and we and. Again, I want to say happy birthday to my dad because it is his birthday and I'm happy for him and I hope he has a wonderful birthday. So, thank you for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed and until next time, goodbye.